hi guys in this video i will show you how to install and customization laravel 12 starter kit with vue.js so let's get started so you can go to the official website of laravel and then you can scroll up you can see that on top right side corner read documents click on it yeah and you can see that there is an installation step so we need to go to the starter kits and here you can see that they already given for react for view and live wire so scroll down and you need to install first laravel installer if you already install then you can check with laravel command so let me show you in my terminal you can see that i already installed it in my ubuntu system laravel installer 5.12 okay so that's fine and let me clear it yeah next you need to create the project with laravel new command so let me do it so i will say laravel new my app and i will do with the view so i will save you and hit enter you can see that it will ask you for a starter kit and this time i am going to choose view okay so if i choose view.js and then they are also asking for which authentication provider do you want to prefer so i will prefer default and then they are saying for framework so paste for testing and let's wait a moment to install entire composer dependencies and also it will set up the env file with the app okay app like app key yeah so let's wait a moment yeah it will ask you about the npm do you want to install the npm and build so yes i want to install the npm and also run the build command okay so let's wait a moment to install and build it yes now everything fine so let me go to the my project so app view okay and now let me clear it okay and let, let me go and open my editor so i will go and php storm okay and open up the project yeah so let's wait and open and let me go here and we created my app so let me refresh it yeah my app view open it trust this project and yeah it's opening okay and yeah and it's loading all the directories okay you can see that now okay and if i go to the composer.json okay we install laravel 12 okay with the yeah jingy and like industry laravel and go to the package.json that you can see that Vue.js all the packages you can see over here okay yeah and now let me run the project okay let me go here and i will say php artisan sir okay and now let me go to the localhost 8000 you can see that by default laravel 12 blending page and if i click on register you can see that brand new register page over here same thing if i click on login there is a new login page so let me go to the sign up and let me create one user over here okay so sign up it so, okay and then i will say email hardik at the red gmail.com let me set up the password okay and click on create account you can see that created account and you can see that brand new dashboard over here with the proper sidebar and all the things okay so this is a looks very good and with the view js so let me go here and go to the resource and js you can see that there is all the components over here like for the sidebar for the handing for the icon for the input and everything and if i go here there is a ui for the card and for the button so everything by default laravel 12 already given and same thing for the layout so you can see that this is different different layout for the authentication for the app okay and same thing you can go to the pages and different all the pages set up are confirm password forgot password and all the settings you can see the password profile and appearance so let me go here and go to the settings and you can see the password appearance you can also choose the dark mode so i will keep the dark mode for now okay now let me show you for the different types of uh, dashboard okay so let me go back and make it again light okay and you can see that this is the dashboard with the sidebar okay now i want to change that okay so let me go here and you can customization that so go to the app okay and here you can see that by default they given for the app sidebar layout 
so that already defined over here app sidebar they already also given another option that's called header so let me go here and i will say header save it okay and now let me go it's changing nothing because it's already built so let me go here and i will say npm run dev so real time update will happen so refresh it yeah you can see over here there is a header with the dashboard and it's removed from the sidebar so you can see this the magic so let me go here and back to the sidebar okay you can see that now also you can change the variant of the sidebar so let me go here and go to the components sidebar and then let me go here you can see that there is a variant so i'm going to use the floating save it and you can see over here there is a you know sidebar is highlighted over here and this main content is like you know deeper right now you can also use sidebar option so i will say sidebar save it and you can see that it's much simpler okay so i will make it again default one okay Insert those so there is a three option they provided so let me go here and you can see let me save it yeah it's back okay so like content is highlighted and sidebar is deeper now okay so same thing you can also add menu over here inside the dashboard with the dashboard so let me go and copy this you can customization that one as well i will say events and here i will say events and let me change calendar icon so i will say calendar save it okay and now let me go here and you can see that there is another menu we added over here okay same thing let me go and log out okay and go to the register page there is a simple by default option they provide this one but they also provide one more of two more options so let me go here and you can see that auth layout by default in view there is a auth sample layout file including and there is a three option over here so i'm going to change this and i will say card save it and you can see that design is changed with the card so you love it right yeah so let me go ahead and go to another option split save yeah you can see that much better so you can see that like uh, with the three options of register and login page with the design so you, and laravel 12 use tilewind css so later you can update and change it as well so i hope guys you understand the, about how to install and customization laravel 12 starter kit with vue.js so if you like this video then share with your friends and subscribe my channel thank you so much for watching guys